this uh, blinking is a signal holding it uh, stable as the gyros uh, get locked we should be able to see in the back the gyro lock it should be that little red light I think we'll have to uh, move some of this wood around to get that out of the way okay now we're in uh, manual mode so let's check all the throws left right up down uh, left right on the ailerons. Now we're going to go into the second mode which should keep everything level. We bank that way, we bank that way, and it looks like that's not quite, it looks like it wasn't quite level on that. We're going to try just pushing the reset button and see if we can't uh, get the gyro stabilization. Note, we'll cut a hole in the wood to get to the reset button. And going back into manual mode. Popping the top off. And pushing reset. Can we get a little bit flatter? Pushing reset. These blinking lights are trying to get the gyro lock. You can see the ABC, and it looks like that's gotten it. So let's check out. We'll just put this on here gently and see if. Okay, here's bank left, bank right, pitch up, pitch down, and that looks not too bad for level. Okay, so we're going to take it up under manual control, and then we'll flip it over to the stabilized mode and see what it does. Okay, I'm using these plastic... Uh, bits instead of a regular screw hopefully to avoid uh, any uh, GPS interference. We're not using the GPS today but uh, for future use. Next time out if the stabilized flight goes well we'll try uh, navigating with the GPS. Okay just kind of pull this tight Get that on there. It looks so nice and tight. 